But what is up, guys? It's me back with another banging video. We're running some Sparky on ladder as I complain to you guys about Supercell again, making it the most pay to play game I've ever experienced in my life. So, if you guys do not know, it is legit impossible to get elite wildcards. I've messaged Max on Twitter, the community manager. I'm like, hey, is there any way you can make elite wildcards more accessible to the market and to like the common player? Because there's just no good way to get it unless you spend money, which I don't think is fair. Um, so, he's like, no, we don't plan anything. We think it's fine right now. I'm like, Bruh, <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, there's no other way to explain how bad the elite wildcard system is in Clash Royale right now. Because even if you, you know, play as, like, super long, if you're a m former max player like me, and you have, let's say, 15k gold, or 500, like, 5 million gold, you're maxed out. My gold is useless. I like, Can I at least convert my gold into elite wildcards, vice versa, other stuff? Because right now, I'm just, there's nothing for me to do other than just sit there and be like, well, that that's just how the cookie crumbles, you know what I mean? So where's Aragon here? He's a great YouTuber. Um, hopefully one day I can get a code too. Hashtag code sweep. Yo, get that shit trending. Um, this could be log bait. Some I could spark here, but like the fact that it could be log bait, I'm not. So it's definitely not log bait. So. Okay. So it's hog. I wonder if he goes uh, with this. I don't like that play. It's two hits, but now I got like a really good push here. Cause he's forced to goblins, maybe even ice spirit. Then I just go things. I go spark here. Then what does he play? You know what I mean? He has to play defensive. So there's a good chance we could actually do a lot here. Um. Yeah, so his hand right now is like Earthquake, Log, Firecracker, and Tesla. So we're going to go Spark in the back here because he's probably going to Earthquake it or set up a Tesla or Bomb Tower, whatever he has. Yeah, I don't like that play. So he's doing that so he can get back to another one. So he's using Evil, Evil Firecracker, which is actually very interesting. Um, we're going to play our Goblin Giant high. I like to play, I like to play my Goblin Giants higher just for the fact that... Uh, okay, that's just kind of that's just kind of unlucky. That's just okay. Uh, that's a, that's, a, that's a little unlucky, you know. I'm doing this because I want. I just. I'm gonna go hog. Go opposite lane. That's great for me, honestly. There, I cannot ask for a better play. Just go in the back here. I think that that was a huge misplay by him. He should just went hog to kite it, and then the other thing. That way I don't have like this like onslaught of a push. I'm gonna go mini pick an opposite lane. I kinda wanna do that same thing again, but like not let my little prince get hit. So now we just go here. And he's back to his yeah. Oh man, this sucker are just broken. A little bit, a little bit of my fault though, to be real. Let's go Sparky here. Good Sparky into his hog. I think hog still gets a hit though. It doesn't. We're gonna Goblin Giant here, try to activate King. Perfecto. Goblins are such a bailo card, bro. Such a bailo card. Let's go Sparky here. Rinse and repeat, baby. I'm gonna go Little Prince high again. He's playing his Tesla's way too uh, high. Can you not? Okay, he fucked up. I think the Spear Goblin's on the tower. Oh. 
What does arrows do? Not enough, that's okay. Nah, that's enough. Beating Aragon, fellow YouTuber, fellow really good player. You know, my goat, my sensei, my baby daddy. Hope you guys like the new setup too. I've been trying to, uh, you know, get my setup doing going a little bit better. Um, I haven't been playing Clash, you know what I mean? Because it's just not... I'm stuck using Sparky, and Sparky's pretty weak right now, to be honest. Like, Sparky's a weak card. And I just want to, you know, do multiple decks for content. You know what I mean? Uh, I'm going to be, like, streaming with Expo later. And my alpha number so Yasu yeah, facing all the goats tonight. All right, he's probably running Hog too. But yeah, I just don't. I want to play more decks, but it's kind of such a paywall that I can't because I don't want to spend seven dollars for a Lee wild card. Then balance changes are next month. You know what I mean? And just blah 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 blah. You know, it sounds like I'm talking a lot, but it's true. It's it's how I feel, and no one should you know have to spend money to want to play this game. I'm um, so you go mini Pekka on these. Yeah, this deck's just broken. That's kind of why I kind of want Fireball and Sparky. So I don't lose to Oyasu running this broken Earthquake Pig Cycle deck. And yeah, like, even if I want to play this deck, I just can't. Because I'd have to spend 70 bucks to get it. And, like, with new cards coming out and Tower Troops, it just feels like they're spending more and more about, you know, trying to monetize the game than actually... You know, make it a good experience for the player. You know, maybe that's just... Okay, I misclicked too. Alright, I'm just tilted. I'm tilted. I'm tilted. Clash for all you. You've successfully tilted me. Alright. Rage all of this. And he just goes in the middle with it. No? Hello? Hey, bro, your tower. Your tower, little bro. Nice. That's my mini P.E.K.K.A. Okay, I just go minions on top of here. Yeah, I feel like he, he didn't have a great hand. Yeah. Let's go minions. Hello? Minions? Okay, now we go spark here. And we're chilling. That's just an arrow cycle. Okay, yeah. GG. Oh, boy. What a game. What a game, what a game, what a game, 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 what a game, what a game, what a game, game, game. Not just arrows range, and that should actually get on tower. Hmm. Yeah, I think we're fine. Evo skeletons again. Yeah, we're chilling. We're chilling. GG. Look how much damage you get when you don't have like an actual like counter. Beating Oyasu. Beating Oyasu. But yeah. So now that I'm this far into the video, after two amazing wins on my ball, I, I want to go over some math with you guys. And you, you guys, tell me if my math is mathing or my math ain't mathing. Okay. So I'm gonna show you the elite wildcard shop, and you tell me if this is not the most blatant fucking scam you've ever seen in your life. Okay. This is literally mobile game logic. So for five thousand. Um, Philly wild cards, it's a hundred thousand gold, okay? And a hundred thousand gold to them is four thousand five hundred gems. And four thousand five hundred gems is worth how much? It is worth exactly like forty, fifty bucks. And then but you could just you could just get two thousand gems and it's the math like the math ain't math thing, you know what I mean? But if you spend seven dollars to get fifty thousand doesn't make sense. The, the math is not mathing. If you consider these prices for how much gold is worth in gems and how much gems are valued, it doesn't make any sense. But it wants you to spend seven dollars. Seven dollars is your max one card. Just so you can play ladder. If you want to try a different deck. And there's so many offers. Look at these. Offers, offers, offers. They just keep scrolling. It's crazy. So yeah, that math is some of the worst math I've ever seen in my life. And it's just frustrating. It is actually frustrating. So we'll play we'll play one more game with Sparky. Um, win or lose. Oh my god, that Q time. Win or lose, I'll throw it in the video. Okay. 
Okay, this is a minor cycle player. He's a really good player. He's Japanese, but I don't speak Japanese. So yeah, basically, it's just, it feels like there's such a paywall to play the decks you want to play. And with new Evos coming out, new balances, you don't, you can't predict what you're going to upgrade to. And there's a cap to like what you could hold on to it as well, which is crazy. Imagine putting a cap on it. His arrows. It's balloon. It's not balloon. It's balloon. That's Snowball Barbaro. We still go night in front of this. Arrows is archers. Okay, I'm fine with this play. So I don't think he's arrows. This is really good for us. Let's go Goblin in the back here. If he wants to go in, we could probably just win the game off it. Is, it like, is, is that a good play? Uh, am I tripping saying like, is that a bad play? Oh no, I locked onto my thing. That sucks. Okay, so now he has Evo um, Archers. So we gotta take that into consideration with what his plan is gonna be. He's gonna go minor with this, like they always do. Mm. Is that enough? Unless I rage it. I'm not gonna rage it. That's an overcommit. Okay, we see this coming. No way, Snowball is so broken, man. You know, talking there just proves how broken Snowball is. Bruh moment. GG. GG. Wow. Nerf Snowball. Nerf Cycle Dex. But yeah, guys. Um... Yeah, that, that was a brutal match. I played so bad, but I, I can admit my mistakes. Um, she just slowed down, went with a uh, Evo Sparky push with Evo Knight, but I didn't. I didn't. I, I'm not used to facing blue in this meta. But yeah, guys, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, comment down below what you think Super Suck could do to make this game less pay to win, or even just pay to play. That's that's what I'm calling it now because you have to. It the only way you could get elite wild cards is to spend money. Is to spend it's legit to spend money unless you just wait two seasons to get one card max and you're just chilling there like oh cool and then it gets nerfed next season you're like oh sick that's gonna get fucked in the ass by supercell that's why I, that's why i respect b-red a lot as a content creator because he actually put his foot down and just, like stood up for the casual player because before people you say oh it's pay to win you know what i mean oh this is horrible level 14 pay to win no now it's actually pay to win now you actually have to spend money for evos champions Level 15, like Elite Walkers, like everything you have, you actually have to spend money on this game. And it's just, it's impossible to keep up. My, my free-to-play account, I can't even play anymore. Because I don't have eight Elite Wild Cards to form a coherent deck, you know what I mean? Oh, it's brutal, it's brutal. But yeah, comment down what you guys think down below. Subscribe if you agree with my opinion. And yeah, guys, see you guys in the banger video. Peace out.